Speaking of events, you can't forget about the eclipse. Organizations in Cape Girardeau have long been planning how they'll celebrate this April. The Arts Council of Southeast Missouri has a lot going on, including the Everyone Belongs Under the Sun Eclipse exhibition and the Constellation Crawl. So, returning back to Heartland Afternoon is Kelly Downs to tell us more about it. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Hey, I'm awesome. So, what can you tell us about this Eclipse Expo? Oh, there's so much. So, right now, there's an artist in town who comes from the Savannah College of Art and Design, and he is going from Texas to Maine oh my gosh. to install site-specific installations. And when he came, his name is Henry Dean, and when he came to Cape Girardeau um, and saw Southside Farms, he decided that Cape was going to be his location, his flagship location for this idea. And so we've kind of come up with the concept that everyone belongs under the sun because we really believe that culture and science and art can all converge mm. to make something really beautiful. Absolutely. What does that mean for you guys to, for, to be selected for this? It's huge. I mean, we really want art to be this connecting point where everybody can look at this festivity. And, and traditionally, eclipses have been these momo like momentous movements mm -hmm. forward for humanity. And so we want this to be an opportunity where we're looking at our neighbors and how we can look at what's going on in our community and s respond in real time to it. Absolutely. So whenever people show up, what should they expect? Okay, so we are going to first Friday, we're going to just have it's parties, 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 you know, but for <laughs> a good cause. So Friday night, we're going to have our traditional first Friday with the arts. And so that's going to include um, an exhibition at May Green, which is for black artists called Reflections. Okay. And then we're going to have something at Riverside Pottery, Ebb and Flow. Our Everyone Belongs Under the Sun exhibition will open up. And then uh, Spectrum and Scout Hall will have live music. And then the next day, which is Saturday, is going to be what's called a Constellation Crawl. Ooh. This is super cool. Okay. So how do we use art to connect points, right? Hmm. And so we're thinking about this, and, and we thought of a constellation. And so uh, we're going to have activities at Southside Farms. We're going to make bee hotels with the kids and then have the uh, exhibition at May Green. Rob Lorenz from Riverside is going to be throwing ceramics. Eben Flow is going to be fermenting a yeast for a beer from the last eclipse. <gasps> so it's going oh. to, it was permacultured, this super cool thing. There's going to be art installations. We're doing a red light painting night with some jazz music and then um, Spectrum and Scout Hall. They haven't announced it yet. <laughs> they're announcing it this coming week, but they're going to have some pretty rad music. I mean, what does that do for the local businesses here and the local music artists as well? That it draws people to our area. When you think about it, we have tourists coming from international mm -hmm. spaces. And so what do we want to say about Cape Girardeau as a place at this space and time, you know? Yeah. And considering that in this sort of cosmic way, um, we really want to look at the message that we're sending to the world. And we really think that it's rural, rural America, even though we seem like this place between St. Louis and Memphis that has been left behind, there's actually something really special happening here, and there's so many people putting their love and their livelihoods into the arts. And so we want to support local business. We want to support local makers, but also draw big names to our area mm -hmm. that will look at Cape Girardeau as a place that they want to come back to. Alrighty, thank you so much. I appreciate My you taking pleasure. the time to thank be here. You. It's always great it's having always you. It's always a pleasure.